Whether or not mermaids exist is a conversation that'll probably be around forever. And as long as that's the case, there's always gonna be reports of sightings, both made up and real. Kind of. Kind of like what we're gonna be looking at in today's video, really. Gokwe and Osborne Dam, Zimbabwe. In 2012, reports emerged that mermaids or humanoid creatures have been spotted near dam construction sites, and they were mad, apparently. The workers couldn't continue with the construction as the strange creatures, referred to as Mamba Muntu in Zimbabwe, wouldn't stop harassing them. In other parts, the mermaids might have been an intriguing sight, but this time it was a little concerning. For the workers as well, they felt the same thing. The appearance of Mambu Muntu could only mean a bad omen, so they fled the construction site, stalling the dam projects. Not wanting to entirely abandon the dam, the government reportedly hired non-locals who didn't believe in Zimbabwean mermaid folklore. But much like the other guys, they were also harassed by the mermaids to the point of leaving the construction site. For any meaningful work on the dam to resume, the Minister of the Water Resources, Samuel Nakomo, suggested brewing traditional beer and carrying out rituals to appease the mermaid spirits. Surprisingly, getting crunk actually worked and they departed soon after. Kiryat Yam, Israel Mermaid sightings were reported over several months by over a hundred different people, which drew lots of attention to the Kiryat Yam city as tourists streamed in, hoping to catch a glimpse of the elusive creature, the mythical creature. So every other local was either actively looking for it on the beach or asking around for info. Even the town's newspaper, The Colonist, got interested, going as far as offering 25000 to anyone who would bring them the mermaid. Arrangements were even made for the creature to have accommodation as she slowly got used to the town but the locals had to move on eventually as she seemingly disappeared into thin air. This led some people to believe that the whole thing might have been a ploy to boost the town's tourist numbers. See you all next time!